I'm going to show you what I use to protect the black trim on my vehicles from graying out. I use this Aerospace Protectant 303. I don't spray it directly on the vehicle. I use a small cloth, piece of cloth, put a little bit on. and then rub it on. And you can see the difference between that and that. So this 303 protectant is not like Armorol. I don't use Armorol. The 303 repels dirt, dust, and water. It also has an SPF of 40. So it's UV protectant as well. A lot of people use it on the dashboards of their cars, on leather seats, on vinyl seats, on outdoor furniture. Uh, any plastic, it's really good for. It protects it and brings it back to life. After you put it on, you just wipe it off with a cloth. You can see the difference over here without it and with it. It has a nice matte sheen. It's not oily at all. And it really protects the black trim on your vehicles. You can use it on this trim. You can use it on mirrors on the outside of your car. Any trim, door trim. This is the back bumper that I used the 303 on earlier. Put 303 on the tailgate latch here. You can use it on your mud flaps, your tires, on rubber. You just want to make sure the surface is clean before you apply the 303. If you can see the difference between that side and this side, that one's done. It's recommended that you apply it every three to five weeks. I don't. I do it a couple times a year and it keeps them really nice. It is the best stuff I've ever used to protect the black trim on my car. You can put it on the lights of your car. I don't. I use Mother's Carnuba Wax for that. You wipe it until it's dry. Don't worry about overshooting it on the chrome. You can clean it right off. You can see what it does. It brings back that black appearance. But there's no oily residue. Aerospace Protectant 303. And that's how I protect black trim on a car. Hope it helps and happy DIYing.